Stock's men will surely take him. Do you ever get used to it? Killing. Faster than you can imagine. Can to keep you stocked in salts. Thanks. survival and then there's finding pleasure in the act Booker. look you seem like a decent enough sort that said less you know about me the better
Vengeance is mine, saith the prophet. I think I understand how you do what you do, these tears. I always thought of them as doors. When I was younger, I didn't just open the ones I found. I remember making them. Making them? I could go wherever I wanted. But I always wanted to come back. To what? I don't know. My family? How do you do that? Whatever it is. You know how I said I had plenty of time to read? I tried to figure it out. I read literature on physics and other such things. Yeah? And what did that teach you? That there's a world of difference between what we see. Yes.
Help with this. That won't take but a minute. Done. When you were unconscious on the beach, you kept repeating a woman's name. Anna. I don't want to talk about that. I, I, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have pried. Where are you from, Mr. New York. What did you do there? Business much like this. Something that really caters writing on a resume. It was a fine thing you came along when you did. <sighs> How do you think I ended up here? I gambled, and now I owe money to men you don't want to be in debt to. I come here to pay it back. Me busting you out. What do you think that was? Charity? Who sent you? Somebody who was willing to take my marker in exchange for you. like they call you the false shepherd. And you the lamb. Let's not call each other that. Suits me. How do you figure they'd know you'd be coming? Either they've got a prophet on their side. Har har. Or them that hired me also wrote the signs. Why? Got me. Just what the doctor ordered. No one... Wait, what is that? 40 North by 74 West. That's not Paris, that's New York. How did you know that? One thing I had in that tower was time, Mr. DeWitt. Time to study things like geography. I owed money. And there's a fellow who... He offered to wipe away my debt in exchange for you. <laughs> Come on. Hey, uh, Elizabeth. <laughs> 
It's gonna be okay. Come on, Eddie. Everything's gonna be okay. Will you just turn around and talk to me and we can- <laughs> Oh, shit. Holy 